thousand people were killed in first few weeks of the occupation. Following these months and years, there were thousands of children, women, and elderly died on the way to exile to the southern desert of Iran. Only after His Majesty was satisfied with the complete suppression of South Azerbaijani movement, he issued a declaration of public amnesty. The state of fear and oppression continued until 1979 revolution without the Pahlavi regime and replaced it with the theocratic terrorist regime of Mullahs. The so-called revolution of 1979 were aborted by abrupt coming to power of Mullahs. Only the administration changed, leaving the system intact. All projects of assimilation, the population, the Turkish, and destruction of South Azerbaijani were followed by Islamic terrorist regime. Oppression were increased, population doubled, and poverty is hundred times worse than before. South Azerbaijani was further disassembled and the name of Azerbaijan was taken from many areas with the pretext of creating new provinces. Name of cities, rivers, roads, mountains and people were changed by force to some meaningless Persian names. Iranian terrorist regime fears of nuclear arsenal only be used as a deterrence for world community not to question the patriotics committed by them inside the prison called Iran. Islamic regime extend feast of terror and barbaric shot of death to America, death to Israel, death to England should not be seen as the attitude of so-called Iranians. There is no such thing as Iranian. There are South Azerbaijani Turks and millions of other non-Persians. And then there is Persian Shia terrorist government in Iran. Iran is a prison of peoples. We ask the world community to distinguish the fact of political and ethnological diversity in so-called Iran. Let it to be let it to be known that South Azerbaijani Turks don't share any of this terrorist regime political views. Let the world know that we have only one enemy, and that is Islamic Republic of Iran. Our enemy don't reside very far from us. They are our motherland's invaders. Persian racism, Persian despotism is our enemy. We will live and fight forever to defeat Persian racism and end Iranian racism occupation of South Azerbaijan. Now, after our 80 years of losing their sovereignty, South Azerbaijan is still under foreign occupation. South Azerbaijani Turks is deprived of their basic human rights such as education in own language, work and live in own land with own culture. South Azerbaijani needs attention of all freedom-loving people in the world. South Azerbaijani Turks need all democratic, non-governmental organizations and governments to hear our cry of freedom and democracy. One, free South Azerbaijani political prisoners. Two, stop random arrest and kidnappings of our activists. Three, stop torture and forced confession on TV and media. Four, free South Azerbaijani Turkish language in our schools. Five, free South Azerbaijani press, radio and TV. Six, Persian administrators and occupying forces 
Persian terrorist army and both recognized terrorist pastoral live South, South Azerbaijan. Long live South Azerbaijan!